It's like the screensaver. I feel so understood by this lyric video. This is absolutely my era. I used to have screensavers like this. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, wherever here, I hope that you are all doing well. So last week I finally listened to Pablo's second album, La On, and that album is full of some serious bangers. They are uplifting, they're punchy, they're experimental, they are fun and pure and happy, and one of those songs was blessed. And we finally have a lyric video for it, and some of you have said, please, you need to watch just how amazing this is, and I don't really know why you're saying that. It definitely looks colourful. I'll give you that. Looking at the thumbnail of it, it looks quirky all right. I had a quick look at the description and I can see uh, all of the credits and everything and I can see that the creative director for this video is Zyan. I don't really know what that means because previously she has given me stuff that has been a lot of storytelling, very like twists and turns and emotionals and I don't know what twist she's going to bring to this song. But what I will tell you is that the past couple of weeks, perhaps even month, has been really manic for me. It's been really busy and, uh, you know, SB19 bring me so much happiness and I feel like I haven't been able to keep up with my fangirling and it's just so sad. And especially since listening to Blessed, I have become reliant on the song. Like in the morning when I wake up, it's the first song that I listen to and sometimes I would just loop it because it's just pure happiness. Okay, you cannot be sad, be tired. You can't just like have enough when you are listening to this song. It's just so gorgeous and I'm really grateful to Pablo for this gift. So please can we watch this music video, lyric video, sorry, together and see what it's all about. I am being told to stand by. So I'm preparing myself, okay? This is going to be all sorts of elegant and... <laughs> no? No? Really? Serve. What a place to stop it. I know. I just want to say before we even get started is that I grew up during this era when you used to work, uh, use word art to create all of this. The fonts, the backgrounds, the special effects, the animations. I am from this era. Thank you very much. <laughs> So my wish list currently is that it needs to be performed every single place that he goes. It must always be performed live, okay? And we need a fan chant. I know that that is very much linked to like Korea and K-pop, but don't you think like every time like he says something, we could be shouting like blessed or mess, like really get involved in it. I know we want to sing the whole song and we are more than capable, but I think that the fan chant will make it really fun. Dance challenge. It needs to have a dance challenge. And when I'm saying that, I want all of those like uncle drunk dance moves to come out. Like I, I need that, you know, that underwater, I need that to be a part of the routine. And also I'm loving everything that's happening visually, but especially that let's not forget, we are talking about the Pablo. Okay. He's a mover. And I really love this little snippet of the dance that they've used for this. They've obviously messed with the timing to make it fit with the song, but let's not forget he serves and he serves hard. <laughs> Come true. I'm blessed by you. 
my face hurts already. Everything gets better with you. Everything you do helps me through just like this. Starting so pretty. Tonight, you're my light shine bright. And I feel alive. <laughs> I get a trick at this love. Did I just say did it loud? Bigger and bigger it got. Stronger like it's from above. Maybe it's Patty before it got right into me. It's been made from a fan, like a real fun thing. I needed to have a dance routine. Something big is coming at the end, isn't it? I feel so understood by this lyric video. This is absolutely my era. I used to have screensavers like this. <laughs> this is gold. You know when I talk about like a song being like a hundred out of a hundred? Well, this lyric video is like a hundred out of one hundred. I'm going to be re-watching this so many times. I'm going to become reliant on it, okay, for my happiness, for my sanity. And don't you just feel so good watching this? This is good for my eyes, my ears, and my heart. <laughs> Sorry, let's just turn on the sun. I am incredibly grateful for this. This is just absolutely outrageous. And what I love about our boys is that despite what, like, whatever level they reach, it never gets to their head. They are always up for having fun, having a laugh, being silly, being playful, and poking fun at themselves. Just goes to show how grounded and how real they truly are. I can imagine Pablo's reaction watching this, him like laughing, that laugh that he has. And uh, this is just all sorts of wonderful and wow, really not what I was expecting, but definitely all sorts of elegant and chic and uh, sophisticated as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> But I, I honestly feel so understood by a video. This is so crazy. Like, it's really appealing to me as a 90s kid. And uh, for that, I thank you, Pablo. Thank you for making me feel included. <laughs> this was so good. It's like happiness in a video. But truly, don't you think? It's such a beautiful song. And it's just crazy to think that, like... He could have given us any other, like, sort of bright or happy lyric video, but he chose to really shove it all in there just so we can really have fun. Because I think definitely with Alon, it's the album of the year for me. It's insane, that album. And when you pair it with La On, it just takes on a whole other like dimension when you listen to the whole thing from start to end with breathe in the middle it's just uh you honestly cannot get any better than that he's a beast he is the alpha he is really one of the leading men in this peapop rise and he's a visionary he is our ceo um and he is really somebody to watch a personality to watch for the future of the philippines for sure
if you haven't noticed from my uploads, obviously, like I'm, I'm not even trying to catch up at this point with SV19. I'm, I'm just watching stuff here and there. Whenever, like, either if I get like a bulk of something, I'll watch that, or something that needs like to be prioritized, I will watch that. But of late, obviously, uh, naturally, I've been watching and listening to a lot of Pablo, and I find myself just drawn more and more to his content and uh yeah it's very noticeable like the way that his songs or his artistry makes me feel because he has this this really different like emotional connection to what he's performing obviously because he is the creator of it all and uh, so it hits really differently when it's pablo and just seeing him finally prioritize himself and knowing that he is this good and that, that those two things are coming together and it's starting to make a lot of noise and he's gone garnering a lot of respect and I think it was the perfect time as well because when I was watching those clips from TVK I was thinking uh, obviously there are going to be naysayers and there's going to be people like why does he deserve to have this seat uh a he deserves to have it because he is one of the, that leading men in that p-pop rise he is that visionary um but also he's the leader of the most successful p-pop group which is sb19 uh, he played a huge role in getting them especially musically uh, to where they are today um and bringing all of that uh, talent to the surface um but also i think it was the correct time for him to release his solo stuff so people could really see who he was as a person because i, I can imagine that people would be like why is he there <laughs> as stell got it in uh, TVG so um, Pablo would have got it in TVK so I think that it was about the right time that he released the album and I look forward to those music videos now I hope that he finds a little bit of time in between to, to slot a few of those out there for us please do talk to me about this music video I can't wait to hear what you have to say and uh, as I say goodbye to you I'm obviously just going to go back and rewatch it again because why not <laughs> thank you so much for watching this with me I hope that you had fun and until I see you next time take care Stay safe. Bye.